How's it going, everyone? I just want to say uh, thank you so much for showing the love and support for the last uh, last video before this one. And uh, right now, today, uh, there's an event going on with comic book sales, half off. I'm hoping everything. Uh, it wasn't really that specific, but it said 50% off blowout sale. So I'm at the location right now. Uh, I got myself a little bit of snack while I wait because I'm pretty much like an hour early. And yeah, let's just get to the books. Hey Kevin. Hey. Is it okay to? Doing? I'm doing good. Is it okay to start looking? Absolutely. Okay. Um, Perfect. So uh, everything's on these tables. It's going to be half off as price. Even the show stock that I put out. Uh, awesome. Because I have a price that normally be two dollars will be a dollar. Cool. I did add a lot to the back wall. Um, Half off the trades. Anything you see, give me a, if you got a question, just ask. Awesome. I was like waiting for this. It's been a while. You posted this like a week ago, right? Or two weeks ago? Uh, yeah, I was, and even last time I had a sale, I did uh, mention that I was going to have something coming on. So the cool. last couple shows, I also handed out flyers for it.
Yeah, I think I'm good. Till next time. Alright, sounds good. Appreciate it. Yep, have a great day. Yeah, good luck with the rest. Uh, later, uh, busy tomorrow, too. Some pretty good bucks. Can't wait to show you guys. <laughs> hey, what's up there, young uh, collectors and uh, comic book community? Uh, let's get to the books. Guardians of the Galaxy number 13. This is an awesome cover with the Ghost Rider right there. I honestly don't know who this guy is, but he's one of the members of the new Guardians of the Galaxy. Newt Mutants number three. I believe this is the cameo appearance of the demon beer or so. Birds of Prey, number 98. I forgot. I forgot why I needed this book, but uh, it's a minor key of a new character introduced. Batman, number 21. I believe this is the Tim, Tim Fox or so. I don't know why there's a leer there. And uh, this one was an awesome cover. Uh, Batman 431. Hanging upside down from a tree like an actual bat. Awesome cover. Captain America number 18. I think this is volume 2. Number 28 of Captain America volume 2. Detective Comics, number 988. This is the introduction of a character called the Firefly. Detective Comics, 827. This is an awesome black and white cover. Next Avengers, number three. I think I have number one and four and seven. I don't remember, but this is my first copy of number three. And the Avengers, the initiative, number one. This is a book uh, that introduces like five new characters or so. Pretty interesting. I haven't read it yet, but uh, I will definitely check it out. And this is probably one of my favorites. Aztec number one, DC. First appearance of this guy. He's not a big character. He's... A minor, uh, minor hero. He's not so crazy. He's not like Blue Beetle or so. But still, awesome book. And I got four copies of these. The Amazing Spider-Man 258. I believe this is the book where everybody was speculating that Peter Parker was going to give up his suit or so for a uh, temporary time. And he would put like a, a, a lunch bag over his head when he needed to. Or that's just how... I kind of heard about it, and uh, it kind of introduces who or what these uh, symbiotic alien form this thing is, uh, where it came from or so. I'm not sure. I'll have to read it. Awesome book. Awesome cover. And next one is Batman and Robin number one. I believe this is the first appearance of Professor Pig, a crazy villain. Batman 511. This is not a key book, but it is a variant DCU logo right here. These are very rare. Uh, scarce. These were not printed as much as the regular direct edition and uh, newsstand editions. Guardians of the Galaxy number 20. This, I believe, is the first appearance of this guy right here. The main, main guy in the cover. Major Victory. And this is an awesome one. The Spectre, uh, number one. I believe this is volume three. It's not an issue. Uh, it's not a key issue, but uh, it's still a nice book. I love the cover. And this is a Golden Age book, Maverick Marshall. If you just not look there, it looks like a perfect, the perfect book. Uh, Western, Bro uh, Western Brooks. I'm not sure. Uh, yeah, it's a cool cover. 
And this one, Teen Titans, number one. This book introduces, like, I believe four new characters right here up in the cover. Pretty cool book. I'll have to check it out. The Amazing Spider-Man 503. I believe this is the first appearance of Loki's daughter. I might be wrong. And the, these first three um, books here, the Flash number 60, I believe this is the introduction of a new character as well. I forgot her name. It's like as Fe Fezra. She is the person who controls the strength force. Unlike Barry here. Barry is the speed force. The next one is probably one of my favorites that I found and this is Wolverine well, Origins Origins number 11. This is where we first see his son Dakin, if that's how you pronounce it. Dakin Dakin, but then his son and without his his costume for the first time. I want to try to find issue number 10 out there in out in the wild if I could. But we'll see how it goes and this is probably one of my favorites and i found it in the long one of the long boxes that didn't have boards and bags bags and boards however you want to say it i need to bag that up real quick after this and the next issue as well wolverine origin origins number 12. i believe this is where dakin uses his name for the first time that we read and see I make sure those don't bend and crease. All Star Comics number two, number two. This is not like the Golden Age one, obviously, but it's still a cool cover. And I got two copies of Superman 643. This is an homage cover. I think, or I believe, it's yes, it's by George Perez, one of the well-known artists. Homage of Superman in his very first own title, number one. Super cool. Next we have, this is not a key issue, but it's an awesome cover. Adventure Comics 473 with uh, Plastic Man and Starman. Roller coaster cover with Lady in there as well. Uh, it caught my eye, so... If I like this these type of covers, I'm pretty sure somebody else out there would feel the same way. Amazing Spider-Man 643. Wait, 364, sorry. With Shocker right there up in the cover. Peter Parker dodging it. Brave New World number... Well, number one, I guess. This is probably a one-shot. 80 pages. This is the... First appearance of the fourth, Captain Adam right here. Uh, I believe his name is Professor Choi. I forgot his first name. Next one is uh, Damage number one with issue number two. I did not know it was in the back. This is my first copy of this book. First appearance of this guy, Damage. I also know that there's a, new, there's a newer Damage as well, but this is probably a different Damage guy. They're both DC. But anyways, Captain Adam number 12. Wonderful, lovely cover with the flag, American flag in the background. Minor key as well. Number one of Saber 2 in his very own title. Secret Avengers number one. The Jaguar number one. This is probably my favorite pickup. I found this in the long boxes and I decided to just pick it up. I didn't know it was a key. It's not too big or so, but uh, it's probably one of my favorite of the pickup. I love these type of covers with old type of art with the superhero covers. But yeah, guys, that was uh, my pickup of the day. I had a great weekend going through those type of events and uh, i just want to say thank you so much to kevin for hosting this event 
having his 50% blowout sale and I really enjoyed it. I had so much fun going through those boxes. I didn't spend all day or all the, the whole entire time looking through those boxes. I just kind of skimmed through. And uh, I really had a, yeah, like I said, a great time. And I hope you guys enjoyed my video. Leave a like, uh, leave a comment if you got the time. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. And I will update you, you guys when I have the chance. But yeah, this is Levi signing out. Take care, guys. Collect responsibly.